Okay, so you've just moved into a new house and you might not be sure at this stage what type of boiler or system you have in your property. Hi, I'm Jack McGovern, MD at The Glow Group here in Lincolnshire. Now, if you don't know what type of system or boiler you do have, it could prove tricky when you're trying to diagnose a fault or an issue. The most common boiler that we tend to come across and work on is a combination boiler. If you've got a combination boiler, everything is sited within the appliance. That means you won't have a hot water tank. So at this stage, it's important that you go up to your airing cupboard open the door and just make sure that you've not got a hot water tank. If you haven't, and you've got around six or seven pipes below your boiler, it's very, very likely you've actually got a combination boiler. A combination boiler works differently from a conventional boiler in that it provides instantaneous hot water. So when you open up your hot tap, cold water goes through the appliance, heats itself up and directly to your hot tap. If you've not got a combination boiler, it's more than likely you've got a conventional or conventional system boiler. This would mean you'd have an airing cupboard with a tank inside of it. So again, at this point, you should be going up to your airing cupboard to make sure you've got a tank in there and checking that out. A conventional or system boiler would not heat up the hot water directly through the appliance. Therefore, there isn't cold water going through the appliance. This would mean you would have a cylinder in the airing cupboard. So your flow and return off the boiler would be indirectly heating the hot water tank in the airing cupboard, which would mean you would have some valves in your airing cupboard as well, which are prone to going wrong quite commonly. So a conventional system boiler is providing you a storage of hot water as opposed to a combination boiler, which is in instantaneous. If you're still unsure or you've got lots of questions about the most practical heating system for yourself, it's best to arrange a free survey visit. I do a lot of them myself, along with my team of surveyors, and we can give you all the information you need.